NIU alumna and award-winning Malaysian pop singing sensation Amira Ali returned to campus for a performance with an ensemble of students from the NIU School of Music to help celebrate the 50-year anniversary of the Center for Southeast Asian Studies. I'm really, really excited about this collaboration because I'm collaborating with the world music students as well as the classical students and also the jazz. So for example, the pianist, he's from the jazz department and we have an amazing string section and um, working with uh, some of the world music um, students as well. It's so thrilling and it's, you know, so exciting to discuss with them and even with the backup vocalist, you know, sharing her opera techniques and how she's trying to implement it into the music is, is such a, um, a, a great learning experience for me. It actually feels really, really nice to be back and very nostalgic as well. You know, walking through the music building and going to the Gamelan room for rehearsal yesterday and meeting my professors, of course, you know. Um, I chose NIU because it had the largest Southeast Asian studies department in the US. I was looking for a place to study world music um, and um, I was working in theatre before, so I was looking for a place where I could actually bridge these two different fields. My music is uh, very pop based but I fuse a lot of world music elements particularly the Malaysian traditional instruments. Um, Malaysia is a multicultural and multi-religious country so we have very diverse ethnic groups such as the Chinese, Indian, Malay, Iban, Dayak, Kadazan. So I try to fuse these elements in my music. NIU influenced me a lot in opening my mind about how I could bridge this traditional music elements with pop or with in modern form in my music. I'm actually very passionate about unity, so I tend to write a lot about unity and equality. The advice that I would say is explore as much as you can and mix with other people from different backgrounds. I mean, this is an opportunity for, for you to learn as much as you can, not only academically, but, you know, um, about different cultures, about life and about being independent and living on your own as well. For some, it might be the first time, you know, living home and living in a foreign place by yourself is completely different than going for a holiday or anything like that. So I, it's a very good personal journey. <laughs>